Hello, everyone out there. Oh, man, we've done it. It's another week. It's another James Bond. I almost said it's more crimes, but does James Bond solve crimes? He's a spy, so I guess he kind of solves war crimes. Um, Dan's nodding, and he's the expert on all things James Bond. Yeah, he's nodding in like a really confident nod, too. Ah, well, we're going to get started here real soon. Uh, in just a moment, we will be fading it to black before you even know it. No time to waste. We're going to be fading that to black. Uh, I'm just going to stall a little more. Do you think... I bet James Bond's committed some more crimes. I feel like he... Dan's shaking his head confidently, but everyone else is nodding their head even more confidently. He's not the good guy, Dan. He's not the good guy. He can be bad. He can be multifaceted. Uh, this, oh, no. He's going to actually do something. Anyway, still stalling for one moment here. Uh, let's just say this. James Bond should go to a, a prison. He should go to prison for a long time. And I want you guys to think about that as we fade to black here. James Bond, think about what you've done during your life prison sentence. It's always right before weekend we do this thing. It turns out when you do a show on Friday every week, that's how that works. You talk about how Hang the on. calendar works? Yeah, I figured it out. I cracked the code. He's right. Yeah. Wait, Friday always comes before yeah. Saturday? I know you all like to go, oh, dummy Dan yeah. here. It's like, no, I got it. I, I know what's going on here. Yeah, I hate to admit it, but he's right. Yeah. You read like the Da Vinci Code or something? Is uh -huh. this, uh, you cracked it. Uh-huh. Sat -ter day. Sat. Day. I sit on on Saturday. Hmm. Yeah, Sun. I'm not day. I'm gonna interject here for a yeah. second. Yeah. This is the pre-show. Yeah, Vinny, can you make sure you're talking to the mic? Sat. There we go. Saturday. Um, what's the first day of the week? It's fucking Sunday, and let's not start this. What? Thing. It is Sunday. Are you I a Monday that. person? I think it's Monday. Look at a calendar. It's Sunday. Look at any calendar. But that's not how like logic works. And also, if you have to think about, I remember it's also time is cyclical, so it doesn't matter. But the structures Flat of our circle. society start on a Monday. And also, if you really think about it in the uh, biblical sense, I'm not a religious person, but there's an argument to be made that a lot of our culture is designed around religion and religious practices. So if you think about it in a biblical sense, uh, the earth started on a Monday and Sunday was the day of rest. So nobody rests the things. first day. I have comments about what fucking day is the first. So here's the th here's my counter argument. Sunday's the first day. The uh, no. Look at a calendar. The leftmost the structure. You read from left to right. The leftmost thing on every okay, calendar that's ever if, existed. How how can Sunday be the first day of the week if it's the last day of the weekend? It bookends. It's the, the weekend week. bookends the week. It's the first and last is the weekend. The, the front end and the back end. And the omega. It's you true. know what? Time and language are a construct. Uh, Nothing fucking matters. I Who oh, that cares? I agree with. That I agree with. Who cares? I'm going to mess around. Talk is. about anything else. I'm going to mess with some stuff. Uh, Dan. Yeah. Who is wrestling? <laughs> Vince Jesus McMahon. Christ. That's like the most I could come up with like engaged in Vincent quickly. Kennedy McMahon is, the is wrestling. That. Is, Vince, yes, he is. Tragically, I think yeah, he's right. I was he that's is, a real shame. He is Vince wrestling. is wrestling? Vince McMahon is wrestling. He is yeah. the Who is the most it. not wrestling? Um, 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 my dad. Is the most not wrestling? I've never seen mm. someone hate wrestling or be as against everything wrestling stands for than my own father. How about... How about Gina Davis? She's not very wrestling. Mm, how, I mean, we, don't, but we don't know how not wrestling she is, is the thing. It's, it's un, okay. untested. I don't know if I've ever seen a Gina Davis movie. Wait, The Long yeah, Kiss Goodnight. You've seen Beetlejuice. Oh, yeah, and The Long Kiss Goodnight. Yeah, yeah there you Actually, go. Actually, Beetlejuice is pretty wrestling. Um... How about remember Figment from the Disney World Disney World ride? Figment and World of Imagination. No, I hate Disney World. World of Imagination. Do you like Disneyland? Uh, no, I've not been there, but I can confidently <laughs> say no. <laughs> I just don't okay. like Disney stuff. There you go. All right. I'm kind of with the. I think Disney World's a little overrated. Yeah, it's. I feel. I mean, granted, the last time I went was like a teen. 
But I feel like the rides aren't that good. That's the thing. I associate a theme park with rides, thrill yeah. rides. It's not about like if, Space Mountain. Yeah, but that's yeah. Space Mountain's a, honestly not even that good. Yeah, it's what, just a janky indoor roller coaster where you can't see anything. What like, about the not, Marvel Studios? Isn't that Universal like, Studios is all right. No, Marvel. There's Marvels. Yeah, that's owned by Disney. Don't they have a Marvel uh, action park in Six Disney? Six Flags does a lot of like Marvel type stuff. Oh, I Disney think Disney owns Marvel. Oh right, they do. Well, that's not always been the case. Six Flags, I feel like, has always been like Warner Brothers. Warner Brothers. Yeah, I don't think. Tunes. I don't think I've been. Yeah, to... they've been Warner Brothers. They Batman rides. They should have Mortal Kombat rides. They're more. They're oh. Warner Brothers now. Oh, I haven't been at Disneyland in like eight or nine years, so I have no idea what they even have anymore. They should be okay. Here's what the Mortal Kombat ride is: you're uh, you sit down, and the front of the car is a fist. It's just a hand, like mm-hmm. th- like th- like a fist, and you're an arm, and you're just. And they're just full size like goros and people there, and you're just punching through them constantly coming out, but like soaked in red gak. Oh, so like they're like giant like animatronic ah! like things, and you, and you burst through, and you just kind of fist? burst through, and like rib cages go flying. And like you see bones breaking on the inside and everything. <laughs> yeah. And what if there was one where it was like a real like tightrope thing you had to walk, and if you fall off, you just fall onto spikes and die. Yeah, and like Ed Boon's head is there. I do it, but a fake one. Yeah, but no, a real one. Uh, no. Ed Boon has to keep making great video games. I'm glad we didn't go with the obvious joke of just a roller coaster that decapitates everyone. Uh, that'd be pretty Mortal yeah, Kombat. Pretty yeah, bad. you could probably do something off that Mortal Kombat three subway level that came back yeah. in Mortal Kombat nine. And they had that fatality where you could just hold their head against the trains that passed by. I don't remember that. God, Mortal Kombat's just the best. No, That's right. Yeah. Yes, it's it very is. good. Should it's we get started? Great. Yeah, I'm just yeah. thinking about Mortal Kombat. All right. Well, uh, think about something else. Okay, we'll it's fade hard. to black like and James Bond. think about some James it's Bond. Also good. Think yeah. about war crimes. All right. What? See you soon.